Public cloud has become a $300 billion industry as enterprises embrace and adopt it. It has seen significant growth over the past decade and will continue to grow well into the future. By 2022, 60% of organizations will be using public cloud to some degree. The question today is not whether organizations should go to cloud, but rather how do they go to cloud? The cost savings, agility, scalability and cloud native services are some of the core reasons why organizations are adopting public cloud. However, going to cloud is not without its challenges. Cloud is different from on-premise environments and requires new operating models and organizational structures to be formed. Enterprises that take legacy operating models and ways of thinking will not realize the full potential and benefits of public cloud. It is therefore critical that a cloud operating model is created and adopted. This model will lay out what capabilities are needed in the organization, which services will be used and how it will be provisioned, managed and governed. Infrastructure provisioning will be one of the first key challenges that needs to be addressed. In most of today's on-premise environments, infrastructure is manually set up which relies heavily on a ticketing and queuing system that can often attract lengthy delays. This process often does not have quality control or the ability to replicate configuration across environments, leading to the inability to debug or test configuration before rolling it out to production. The key to solving this challenge is to templatize infrastructure and service configuration and adopt DevOps methodologies and techniques like infrastructure as code. Infrastructure as code is the practice of using code to describe infrastructure which is both human readable and machine consumable. This is where Terraform from HashiCorp comes in. So what is Terraform? Terraform is a human readable configuration language called HashiCorp Configuration Language or HCL for short. Developers describe the desired state of the infrastructure and Terraform will determine the execution order to achieve the desired state. Once this has been completed, Terraform stores the state of the infrastructure. When subsequent additions or changes are required, Terraform will work out the differential in the state and will make targeted updates as needed. This provides a great user experience for developers and cloud teams to make infrastructure changes safely and predictably. We know that security is one of the top concerns during the cloud journey. There are plenty of news articles about data leaks and breaches caused by misconfigured public cloud infrastructure. These leaks often include misconfigured S3 buckets and Elasticsearch instances without authentication, allowing attackers unfettered access to highly sensitive data. To solve this challenge, configurations that have been approved need to be implemented. This is something that Terraform modules can enable. Modules are reusable and adaptive building blocks for cloud infrastructure and services. They are a set of predefined and pre-built Terraform code which describe common architecture patterns used in the organization. They are created by experts in the organization such as a cloud team to be compliant with the required standards and policies. Once these modules have been created, they can be uploaded to source control and module registries where they can be consumed by the rest of the organization. By using modules, developers and IT professionals know that the infrastructure that they are creating adheres to company policy even if they are not experts in the infrastructure that they are creating. Thus, a developer does not need to be an AWS S3 expert in order to use the service in a secure manner. This can have a significant impact on workplace productivity as it enables developers to focus on solving business problems rather than focusing on the undifferentiated heavy lifting of setting up infrastructure for their applications. Security teams can use the Sentinel policy as code framework to ensure module use and compliance. Sentinel can also enforce standards such as the type of infrastructure that can be created. Developers and cloud engineers at Synthesis love Terraform for its versatility, ease of use and its extensive provider support with over 200 supported providers for hardware, cloud and software as a service providers. If you would like more information on how to unlock the cloud operating model for your organization, please join our webinar that we'll be hosting in early November. Links are in the description below.